That's a clean room for a space project. There is a high-tech company here on Pittsburgh's north side that's headed for the moon and has hundreds of millions of dollars in NASA contracts. The company's called Astrobotic. Its CEO, John Thornton, gave Governor Wolf a tour of operations here. The company is building lunar landers to go to the surface of the moon on unmanned cargo missions. Pittsburgh used to be the city of steel. It's now the city of advanced manufacturing of AI and now the moonshot. The lander that we're building is the largest lander since Apollo. And it's going to be driven remotely. It's going to be operated remotely right here. Everything from building the equipment to testing it to remote controlling it will be done here. We are Pittsburgh's local space company and we are building lunar landers to go to the surface of the moon and building them here, operating them here, and uh, running the whole mission control right here in Pittsburgh's north side. A nonprofit called Moonshot Museum is planned to locate here. It will have exhibits and give the public a window on the work here while it's happening. Well, that is quite literally where we are going to be controlling the landers and seeing that data come back. So that celebration shot that you see after space missions, it's going to happen right here. Astrobotic has already won hundreds of millions of dollars in NASA contracts over the past few years. The high tech work that goes on in this building Building, what it does to attract people, what it does to attract attention to the new Pennsylvania that is emerging out of the ashes of the of the old. And it's it's really an important message. And I really truly believe that what we're doing is bigger than our company. Um, if Pittsburgh and Pennsylvania can land on the moon and lead our nation back to the moon, we can do anything. Inside Astrobotic, here on Pittsburgh's north side, Bob Mayo, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.